another one. Look at that. All right, you guys. I really honestly wasn't even really planning on filming. I just figured I'd bring the camera along, but might have just found some crappie spawning on these rocks right here along this bank. So caught one off camera and I broke off another one I thought was a bass, but it might have been a crappie. So we're going to get over here and look right along this bank right here, these rocks. So, all right. So I'm just using the uh, eight foot Russ Bailey Signature Series b and I got, uh, I think this has eight pound line on it. And I have a little um, Camo Joe custom hand tie on here. I don't know, but broke one off and then caught a nice one. And I haven't really fished that much. So maybe there's more. And it was a female too, which is very interesting to find a female. There's a little dock over here and everything. I've never been back in here before. It's pretty cool. There's one. Oh, that's a bass. Dang it. Green carp. That might have been what I, I thought that's what I had on that other one that broke me off. Large mouth. Probably on a bed right there. It's pretty fish though. They're up like this, and I know some places to check. Let's go across this bank real quick. All right, I'm gonna start dipping. We're getting into some really good looking stuff right here. I don't like the shade for this, but you never know. Yep, I told you, right there. Nice fish too. Come on in here, baby. Yes. Told you we were getting into the good stuff. That did not take long. The boat's gonna go right in there. No, come back this way. Get away from this. Look at that fish, y'all. Big old female, too. Mm. Camo Joe. Nice fish. I'm gonna put these in here. If we get enough, I'll take them home. Definitely. Wow, that's awesome you guys I was like hmm this is definitely a pattern going on definitely just saying I wasn't sure about the shade but I guess the shade don't matter <laughs> that was quick this boat's just gonna be hard to do this with without spooking them I like the size too. These are all females with eggs. Where are the males at though? Crappie. Nice one too. Yep. I'm about to get into them, you guys. I was just like, let me drop out a little deeper. Sure enough, fish jumping back there, a turtle, probably a turtle. I'm all turned around, I forgot I'm at the back of the boat. Nice fish. Just keep coming through here pitching. And they'll get right up on the bank too. Two that I've caught have been probably, you know, a few foot off, but doesn't necessarily have to be the case. There's another one. Oh, that's a bass. We're getting a... These bass are spawning too. That's why we're catching bass. These bass are spawning. That's a little female. Yeah, so these bass and crappie spawn at the same time. And that's why we're catching, we're going to catch a lot more of them too mixed in, I'm sure. It's fat fish. Mm. 
another one. I just said that, and they're on the rock, on the wood now. <laughs> oh, they're mad too when they come out of there. Another female. Interesting, interesting. They're all keepers. There's a little male. There's a little male. Mm, he's close, we'll let him go. It's the first male. See, and this bank right here is gradual. I don't think they're gonna be on this. It's not as steep. Yeah, we're gonna bypass all this. This bank right here is money looking. It's rock, it's steep, it's the same as over there. stuff right up in here should should have a fish or two yep just like that just what I was saying, you guys. It's a dark male. Pretty fish, too. It's just gonna mess me up because I'm gonna have to drift. Ooh, he is mad. Pretty fish. Another one, look at that. <laughs> That's so fun. Right in the same place. It's funny, I mean, you can. I can already tell, like I said, like what's gonna hold fish and what's not. I mean, that one got it, another pretty fish. Oh, bass. We're spawning in the same place. Big one too. Look at that one. Ooh, that one didn't even really fight. I mean, that's a hog. Come here. That's a nice fish. Yep, look at that. That fish has been spawning right there, no doubt. Beautiful fish. That bass and crappie were spawning right next to each other. It's just funny, they're the same 
they're related, so that's funny how they choose the same stuff. <laughs> Little bitty one. He's spawned though. I mean a monster. Oof. <laughs> that's pretty funny. carp nice one he's mad too big old dark male Nice one. All right, you guys, I hope y'all enjoyed that. Finally got on some spawning crappie. Um, decent numbers. Excuse me, it was a, wasn't a real big area, but caught enough in there to, to keep it interesting. And some dark males and some females still with eggs. So we're still, in my opinion, we're right in the middle of the spawn. Um, it's just been late, <coughs> excuse me, it's been late this year, so I feel like we're just now really in the peak of it. Um, and then after this, they're going to move out. So water's 67 degrees. It's prime prime temperature, usually about 70 is when they really start, start spawning and getting done and start pulling back out. So we'll see. We got a little bit ways from that, a little bit to go for that, I should say. Um, still kind of cool. It was kind of cool this morning, so... It'll get there, but for right now, there's still fish spawning on the lake. Just got to get out there, especially rock. Um, you know, rock, riprap, things like that. Definitely good good places to look right now. So, yeah. I hope you all enjoyed that. Don't forget to like if you enjoyed this. A comment if you have any questions down below. I'll definitely get to them. Subscribe if you haven't. Hit that notification bell if you can. That really helps me out. And, yeah. Hope to get on some more pretty soon. If not, I'm going to keep trying. Hope y'all have a great day and talk to y'all later. Another one. This one's this is definitely a sign that they're shallow spawning. Alright, so what I'm doing, using my graph to find the grass. I hope I don't know if y'all be able to see that, but there's some grass on the bottom and you can pick it up on the fish finder. So I'm trying to find the wad of it and fish it. Those crappie are gonna be pretty relating pretty closely to that uh, grass because they're spawning in it so that's what we're gonna concentrate on and I'll just kind of you know fan cast through here too maybe pick one up one or two up like that and there's not grass everywhere as you can see there's no grass right here Really, a little patch of it. I really want to focus on the big wads of it. Big patches. Because that's where it's more likely to hold some crappie. Alright, so I'm just drifting along and I smell fish big time. You'd be surprised how many times you can smell them. Thinking in here, there's got to be some fish somewhere. Sorry, I didn't get this on film, but look at this beautiful black crappie. Oh my goodness, y'all! I'm not gonna, lie, not gonna lie, I can't even talk. This is one of the beautiful, most beautiful crappie I have ever caught in my life. Look at that. Sweet. First piece of the puzzle. Sorry I didn't have that rolling, but it's real weird. I'm trying to trying to find some fish and there's tons of people out here, so that's the first one though. Sweet. It's so dark, I thought it was a bass. Well, that's good. That lets me know the fish are still trying to spawn. I'm really trying trying to figure out if that was the case or not, so.
Now I'm all turned around, but work with it. That fish was in like five foot. There's some scattered grass on the bottom over here. I can see it on the grass. And another one. Look at this one. Sweet. Beautiful crappie. Ah. Settle down, bud. Beautiful crappie. That one's probably a female. She's probably spawned out. Can't really tell, but look at that gorgeous fish. Yes! Beautiful black crappie. Okay, so you can see it right here on the graph. There's some grass that's out here a little ways. And I think that's what's holding these fish. Really would like to jig and bobber these fish too if I can. Let's see. Let me get back over here. Definitely a little something going on right here. Hmm, there's one. As soon as I was getting ready to drift off of it. There we go. There we go. Right on that little patch of grass, just like I was saying. That one slammed it, but he kind of was a little funny about it. As soon as I got ready to leave, he jumped on it. So, it's a keeper, I'm pretty sure. We'll check him, but he'll go. Yep, almost 11 inches. Beautiful black crappie. String him up and uh, see if we can get him figured out a little bit. Another one. This one's this is definitely a sign that they're shallow spawning. So that's what I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna work this whole area over. I wasn't even trying to catch that fish. I'm trying to fish under the dock, and that fish jumped on there. I thought I had a bass. That's what I'm gonna do is just drift down this shore and just pitch this jig in this grass. Big water grass right here. Another one. Oh yeah. Sweet. Nice fish. Nice fish. Ooh, yeah. That dude is mean. Another dark male. Sweet. We're getting somewhere now needed to kind of get a pattern together and I think we got it so patterns definitely just pitching it in this grass they're not like heavy heavy in them they're just the problem is there's so much grass so it's gonna scatter them around a little bit but fish cut me you keep pitching it long enough you will catch a fish wish it would be like a jig and bobber bite, but they don't seem to really want that. Another one. 
Look at that perch. Oh my goodness. Whew. That is one of the biggest perch I have ever caught. <laughs> Look at that dude. Okay, he's going home too. <laughs> we call them perch here in Texas, but they're bluegill. That's definitely one of the biggest ones I've ever caught. Like for sure. When you can string it up, you know it's big. That's awesome. All right, y'all, caught a couple up shallow, like as y'all saw in that grass spawning. That was really it, though. Worked that little bank over, only caught those two. I don't know. I want to go try a different area and see. There's some docks over here, there's some brush piles. There's some grass, so. With a little luck, we can go over there and find some. So let's see. Hope y'all can see that. So all those fish sitting right above that little piece of brush. There's one. First drop. A bad little crappie. It'll be close. That's probably a post spawner. Oh, she's she's got eggs coming out of the side of her. That's weird. <laughs> I think something cut her on the way up. Something cut her on the way up. Oh yeah. Let's keep her on the brush pile, sitting up above it. Throw her on here. It didn't take long and I like that so what I did though is I looked at the grass you could tell those fish were sitting up above it so I dropped down to that depth that I saw them at Let's see if I can do it again maybe a whole bunch of them It's another good, you know, technique right now because a lot of times they, uh, a lot of times there's fish using these brush piles as uh, staging areas, and when they're done, you know, they'll pull out here on them. Drifted off of it. Just dropped my paddle. This is a mess right here. And I'm all tangled, of course. And he popped off. Awesome. having difficulties try and pitch out a little bit on them it's so hard to do this in a kayak it really is
I heard one. A good one. Nice fish. Nice brush pile fish. That fish got it. Look, you can see we're right over the top of it now. I'm gonna drop down on them if I can. See if we can get another one real quick. All right, we hope y'all on the mic on this, but hope y'all enjoyed this. Uh, a little different uh, black crappie spawning in the hydrilla. If your lake has black crappie and grass, right now there's probably some fish in it. Um, you're gonna have to cover water, cast around, and when you catch one, just kind of slow down. But that's what you got to do, and we'll catch some big males. And I caught uh, one female too, I think. But the problem here is just there's so much grass; it just really scatters them out. So that's the biggest issue. But still have fun. leave me a thumbs up if you enjoy. If you have any questions, be sure to comment them down below, and I'll get to them. Thanks again for all the support. And we'll see you on the next one. Y'all take it easy. Good morning. We are headed to meet up with uh, Mark, Crop of Killers. We're going to go down here and see if we can get on some wading fish. Super warm this morning, 70 degrees. So we're going to see what we can get into. Excited. I haven't waited in a long time, so I'm excited to see you know get get back in the water and, and get back in there with the fish. It's kind of like uh, you know, it's more how do I say it? It's more hand-to-hand -hand combat in there with the fish when you're in the water with them. So I'm excited. Let's go. First one. He's darkened up pretty good already. He hit it pretty good. Yep. In the 401k as much as I can, as quick as I can, and uh-oh. This one's gonna be a, that's what you call a combat fishing right here. That's a good one, that jig just fell right out. Yep. Pretty fish. Just okay. Got it too. Can't even see that jig, it's gone. <laughs> I mean, that one got it.
they're all like the same size like good you know good sized fish solid fish yeah Sure is fun. You just don't know when you're gonna drop it in there and get your your uh, socks knocked off. Water's still pretty cool. Yeah. definitely warmer than most places I've been fishing because you can feel it like it's it's chilly oh yeah Are they mostly white crappie or mixed? mixed. Don't even pay attention. <laughs> yep. Yeah. I guess I'm curious because I'm used to just catching whites only. There's not a whole lot of black crappie up that way. There you go. Female. Yeah. Oh yeah. Appreciate it. Yeah, she's ready. Drop it, you just don't know where they're at. Drop it right in their face. I just always just move them back and forth. Yep. I mean, you can't do that with like, a lot of bugs and stuff like that, but. Online, you just don't know. You don't know which way they're facing. Yeah, you just don't know. You don't know if they're on the job or on the front. I'm in a new area, I'll just blow through that area until I get one. Yep, and then you'll kind of slow it, slow down and work it over. Yep, little areas that they'll, they'll get in. Oh, yeah. Oh, dang it. Yeah, this is a good one, too. Soft bite. I didn't even fill him on there. I just picked up and he's swimming off. I mean, soft. Yeah. Man, they're mean. They ain't playing around when they get hooked. 
Good fish. I uh. Well, and then too the weather, man. The weather's perfect. You know that's. Oh yeah, it's not cold or. get really good that one bit the same way just swam off with it I was ready for that one though you're not used to that during the this you know when they're up shallow usually they, they slam it there you go yeah that's a that's a big male I decided to start doing antis during the spawn. Oh yeah. I kind of keep changing bodies all the time. Yep. Because they don't care this time of the year. No, they don't. That's uh I think a lot of people don't realize that. They're not they're not feeding, they're just getting it away from their nest. Yep. They're they're constantly moving up. Not just that, but I mean, well, I'm following you. Yeah, that's true. Yeah, that that's true too. Yeah. With the temps last night, I don't think it really makes a difference today. It's warm. Yeah, warm all night. A super light bite. I mean, super light. Another one. Almost didn't even set the hook on that one. Soft. Solid fish. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, don't get hung up in that. Yep. Go along them. Yep. Oh yeah. And you can just drag it along it, you know, there could be anywhere. Y'all see that snake up there? I don't know if y'all can see it. Right there. Big old snake. I think it's a water snake. Another one off camera. Big male. Oh, 
that's a big one, dude. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. two pounder. All right, y'all, we're gonna go try and catch some fish today on a windy March day. This is not my boat. I'm going with someone today. There he is, right there. I don't know if y'all can see him. Let's get a little closer. But we're gonna see if we can catch some fish. At least try and get out of the wind a little bit. But there he is. You ready? Ready to kick your butt. Ready as you're gonna be. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna get get going. So. You still got that big bucket in here? Yep. It's good luck. Got that one. He got it down a little. Yeah, I knew they were smaller. Oh. I'm sorry. There you good. So I'm using the uh, salt and pepper yeah, kind of silvery shad looking thing. There you go. Look at them fish up on the. Yeah. Yeah, they're they're up in there. Dude, they're in no water. They're in two, three foot of water. That one spooked off. It's really hard to get to them, man. I can't even see where I'm at. Daddy fishing the same stuff. Got him. There you go. Midwater column right there, right out about eight, eight feet, seven feet. That one got it. Would you hand me those needle nose yeah. on your foot? I'm getting the little ones. That's not right. Hey, that's how it's that's how it's gonna She's be. You better. Eggs. That's a keeper. That's I don't know keeper. if you want it. Yeah, I'll keep it. Huh? Yeah. Go and open the box and I'll... Oh, watch your back. Watch your back. Watch your back. Ridiculous. Oh, the water came out. Yeah, dude, they're, they're that in here. Water, that one was swimming up here. It was one of those. What? Oh, yeah. That's a bunch of them right there. I think I got it. I think I'm in there. I'm not sure. Dude, there's... Oh, yeah, I was in Yeah, him. you were. You were. I was in him. Oh, oh I no. I didn't get him, dude. I didn't get him. Dang it. But I was there's in there. There's some brush. I got a fish. Oh, Look at you... that. Yep, well, they were there. That's some brush, too. They were in there. Right in there, dude. Like I think I was actually crazy. recording on that one. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. That's a female there. She's close. Oh, yeah, a little fat female. I'll let her go. She's too close. I was hung up and popped it off and she, she hit got it. got it. Yeah. Coming out. If I need to, I can hold this up here. We're off. We're not spot locked right now. We're just sitting. Oh, oh there you go. Oh, he came off. It's like they're not get. They're just mouthing it. They're not getting it. Because they don't want to eat it. They just want it away from them. Golly. The worst sound you can hear. Oh, I got one. You do. Oh, that's a nice one. Get them out. Dude, I wasn't even looking, man. Four pounds. Dude, I wouldn't. I looked off at you at the thing and saw some, and I knew they were in there. holding it dead still. They're in there. Nice one. What I was doing, I just know I was holding it there and. Look up there on the bank. Huh. What did that? I don't know. You think that guy did that? Why would he do that? That's weird. Think he, that's that fish he caught and he left it. He's going to come back for it? Maybe. That's weird. If it's alive, we should get it. Yeah, that's weird. <laughs> Hope so. Or maybe he's around here somewhere and he's just walking down the bank. I don't know either, dude. I, that's what I did. Look, another one. Yep, yep. Oh, get her. That's a male there. 
There, so just hold it under the boat and just leave it dead still, man. And that's what I was trying to get to. I see fish. Ah, golly, this thing is mad. Golly, dude. That's let me, a male. Let me, let me turn and get a picture of it. Hold on. All right, money. That's a good one. Yeah. That one's got. That one's got a little color. Holy yes. <laughs> scale in here no, no i don't man that's I a big one I, 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 yeah i wish i did oh man that's pushing two for sure if hold, not over hold him see what you think in your hand yeah he's that's a monster dude yeah look he's colored too he's ready oh man that's a big big fish I'm proud of that one. Well, that's a good one. <laughs> I'm proud you of that one. You ain't got to question that one. <laughs> Woo! That one uh, got the memo. <laughs> that one got the memo. I wish they all got that memo. Hey, they're here. Yep. We just got to find them, dude. They're here. There it is. There it is. Got him. Got oh, him. Got him. big one. Got him. There you go. <laughs> money. Money, money, money. Yeah, there's a few on there. That. Black toad. crappie again. That's a toad. Oh. That's a North Texas dog right there. Who cares about East Texas? We're talking about North Texas. Right? North Texas. I didn't even give him a chance. No, he oh. he was all over it. <laughs> I just put a he didn't know space. he didn't know what happened. What just happened? Got another one. Oh, oh that's a big one, dude. Yeah. Oh, that's nice. two pounder. Get him! Get him! Get him! <laughs> Woo -hoo -hoo, two in a hey. row, guys. Like, that's a big one there. <laughs> that's. A money that's... Your stop off. Fourteen feet out, though. Can't that. That's a good one here. You got one. Yep. Nice. Ooh, that's a big dog. <laughs> Let's see. That one's heck yeah. Fat too. Fat. Look. Chunked Gone. It. Chunked it down. Hungry fish. Hungry fishes. Yeah. Oh, she's oh, she's man. bleeding too. Huh? She's bleeding too. You got it down in there. There we go. Just like this, just back here doing this. Deep water fishing, huh? Yeah. Soft bite, like I picked up and there was weight. I mean, a big one. I see him moving around. Let me see him. Oh, he's dark. Fish. He's ready. Got a Sunday best on. Wasn't rolling again. Hard to film a video with the camera turned off. It Let is. me see. Look at the thickness on that sucker. That's a good one. Woo! All right, there's some more in there. That's a monster. Oh, he's got me on big fish for sure. That's a monster, dude. That's, that thing right there is a monster. Man. Take him. Oh, yeah, I know. He's. Yeah, that's. He's pushing two pounds. Yeah. I don't want to see them. Yeah, that's. I, I don't want to see them for. Yeah. I don't really want to see them. <laughs> see them? Uh, yep. Right up here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I got one of them. Oh, yep, I see it. Those guys. Seems like those guys are holding on the structure away from the bank. Yep. And they're blacks. Are they? Is that a black? Yep. A little male though. How skinny he is? Yeah, a little skinny. Nice. That's that's, that, that's definitely fish. Well, yeah, that's and it's definitely a pattern about the size and the depth. Yeah, it's know? another male. It's a keeper. It's an eater. 
hard to keep those whenever you have. Right, you're right on them, dude. Huh? Ooh, better one? Yeah, Acts mad. like it. He's mad. Oh, oh my goodness. Got that <laughs> jig gone, too. <laughs> nice. Dogs. What Let me think? try and double up and get one too, real quick. Sorry, man. You're good. Look at yeah, that that's guys. a good one. Monsters. Thank you. I'm just a live well man. Live well full. Oh. He's close, I let him go. Morning, y'all. Forgot my sunscreen, so I'm having to be like this. Can't believe I forgot it. But. We're gonna go try and catch some crappie. Um, that's the main goal. Don't know what else we're gonna get into. Maybe some sandies, I don't know. Um, but we're looking, lake's a little high. I'm trying to find some shad. That'd be good if I can find some shad, but I don't know if I'll be able to find any. Trolling this jig behind the kayak, see if we pick up a sandy or two. Going to the spot, so let's see what we can get into. Making our way to the first brush pile. We'll see. See when we get there how it looks. All right, there it is. I think. I don't know. It kind of looks different than I remember it looking, but maybe it's just got more fish in it. Might have to break out the ten footer. Get a little more reach. Yeah, there's the brush. There's the fish. Not a bad little fish. Be a keeper. First good fish of the day. Oh yeah, now we're sitting on it. You see it right there? We're in the money now. It's a keeper fish. Fish. Oh, that fish slammed it. Look how deep that fish got it. Gotta get used to the long rod again. Haven't fished a lot with it a lot since last summer. something oh, got my other jig look at that <laughs> it's like something's going on yeah this thing is drifting a lot still Go ahead and let this fish go. I don't think I don't want to drag fish around everywhere.
Got a little sporty out here. Five to ten mile an hour winds once again. Gonna have a lot of water in the kayak. Just got the big crop of the day off camera in this timber. We might have to go through here and fish this timber. Shallow timber. Good fish. Spawned out female. Hmm. This is very interesting. Another fish on the trees. We might have stumbled onto something here. These fish just aren't quite done being up shallow yet. Gonna use this long rod and dip around these trees. Just probably make it a little easier. There's a fish. Ah, oh, it's a green carp. Dang it. Ouch. There's one. Big dark male. Look at that one. Big old dark male. So they're still spawning pretty pretty good it looks like. Or at least they haven't pushed out quite yet. Ugh, come on. There we go. Pretty dark male. Five foot of water on a stump. Carp responding. Ooh, I don't know why that felt like a bite. There's another one, little one. They're definitely, okay, we're gonna to do something with this long pole. They're definitely in these trees. Just now figuring it out. I'm thinking they're spying in here still. That's what it seems like. Sorry about the noise. I'm testing the tornado sirens today. I would like to be able to fit. I don't know why that wind's coming from that way. It hasn't been coming that way the whole time. Another one. Their reels kind of scattered, just having trouble staying on the trees. Another male. Peeing. Let him go.
They're not loaded on every tree, but if you fish enough trees, you will get bit. There's one. Oh yeah, look at that one. Let's see if I can get him. <laughs> Come on, long pole. That's a good fish. Another male. I'm definitely going to get that short rod out because this thing is hard to handle. But pretty fish. Wait, that's a big old crappie right there. Look at that. Really don't want to break off again. Should kind of let me off right here. There it goes. Uh-oh, another one. That one was just random. Wait, that's a big old crappie right there. Look at that. <laughs> okay. Sweet. Look at that guy. Beautiful, beautiful crappie right there. Full spawning colors. Wow, that is a beautiful fish. Not expecting that, but I will take it. Thanks, man. That fish was so dark, I thought it was a smallie. Okay. Another crappie. Post spawn female right there. She's actually spawning still. Check that out. I'm gonna get a picture real quick and then throw her back. All right, we'll let her go back. I'm not keeping anything today. Crappie love spawning on these rocks like this. Another one, that's a sandy. Sandy. Little white bass.
rocks. Sandy on tube. Just got bit right here. It felt like a crappie. Probably won't come back either. Dang it hit it so hard too. Something. Uh oh, Sandy. There's another one with him. It's so cool when they do that. <laughs> I bet we'll drop down and catch that one too. Everything likes this little tube. Pretty little white bass. Just kind of swimming through it looks like Alright y'all, hope y'all enjoyed that crappie and white bass from the bank. Um, pretty cool place to find fish like that. Um, just goes to show you never know. And uh, yeah, fish are biting you guys, so definitely get out there when you get a chance. Uh, shad spawn deal is still just getting started, so that's going on too. We're getting into that time of year where everything's just going to bite and it's just going to be the good the rest of the year. Until winter gets here and then it's going to slow down, but get to that point so all right y'all i hope y'all enjoyed and don't forget to subscribe if you haven't hit that notification bell that way every time i post you guys get notified and uh, hit that thumbs up youtube likes that um that helps me out and leave a comment down below if you have any questions i really appreciate it um, this is what we caught all but most of the fish on um yeah really good day cannot complain from the bank so i'm gonna head on to the house catch the next one y'all take it easy